Uh, before we begin, if you like what we do, we are Cincinnati's comedy podcast. Yes. You can go to www.irritabledadsyndrome.com, find mm-hmm. all of our links, follow us on Twitter. Yep. We have a YouTube channel. That link's back there. All of our previous episodes with descriptions, um, a searchable index. There's all yeah. kinds of fun things on there. You yeah, can also I mean, leave reviews, send us notes, um, get in contact with us, what you would like to see on the show. So go visit us there. We've been doing this for a while now. There's I a mean, lot of we stuff have, there. We have more than 130 episodes on there. Yeah, there's, and a, a lot of them are really, really good. Yep. And there's a lot of videos up on our YouTube channel, so go check that out. Yeah. Good times. How you doing? I'm okay. Where's, I'm kinda... where's the mustache? Uh, so... <laughs> Here's what happened. I started growing my facialness uh-huh. to goad me into losing weight. Well, right. <laughs> that did not work. Right. And I hit a point where I knew I was going to have to shave at some point this weekend for work. Yeah. Something going on at work. I could not walk around like that all week. So yeah. I'm going to have to do it anyway. I went into the bathroom and I decided to have some fun. I shaved all of it with the exception of a very porny stash. <laughs> And yeah. it, I came so close to cutting myself while shaving because I busted out laughing as I was creating that monstrosity. And then you I wanted... look like Freddie Mercury's less popular younger brother. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so then I wanted to see how long it would take for my family uh-huh. to notice that. I walked out of the bathroom. Andrew looked at me and he said, what did you do? I'm like, oh, this is going to be good. Yeah. yeah. Beth saw it. She immediately started laughing. The uh-huh. only person that didn't react was Charlie. Yeah. Uh, he reacted much later, maybe 20 or 30 minutes later, he came to find me in the house because Bess had said, did you see daddy's face? Yeah. And he saw it and he immediately said, you need to shave that. Yeah. So we took nice. pictures. We did the whole thing, posted it on Facebook. Well, we were supposed to go to dinner that night at an Italian restaurant. And Bess said, you have to <laughs> wear yeah. that yeah. to the, you know, uh, to our friends, you know, they need to see you like that in the restaurant. I said, Okay. But the the husband saw my picture on Facebook, liked it, laughed, all the thing. I was like, well, he's seen it. Yeah. Plus, and this is more important, I was going to the gym in between that time and the time of the restaurant. And I'm okay. As a matter of fact, I think it's kind of funny, the idea of me out there lifting weights with the porn stash on. So uh-huh. something about that gets uh-huh. me giddy. However... <laughs> I do use the locker room at the gym. Yeah. And I do not want to be walking around in the locker room with that on my face, scaring children. There's children in there. Yeah. I don't want to scare them. Tell me something. Why Mm. is it that if you know somebody who does not have any facial hair, and then all of a sudden they have it, yeah, and then they have a mustache, it looks crazy. (laughs) But if you meet someone for the first time, and they have a mustache, you never think anything about it. Well, when I was starting to shave it off... You know, I had the stuff coming down here, mm-hmm. like like a, yeah, the connect, like hardcore. Yeah, um, I played around with the idea of just shaving that off and leaving it because my dad had a mustache. Yeah, as long as I knew, like mm-hmm. his entire life, he had a mustache. Um, I'm toying around with the idea after this week of regrowing everything and then bringing back the stash, and I may, I may stick with that when we go on vacation. <laughs> good good it time. Be fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So what I was telling you at the beginning of the show... Yeah, you ditched your kid. I I didn't ditch him at all. Okay. So Cameron went to a weekend uh, spring camp thing for our church, okay? And uh, I drove him. It's Friday night. I get home, or I I work from home. So I get off work. I come upstairs, and my wife, Libby, (laughs) says, Darren, you need to take Cameron to... Uh, to the, to our church, can you do it? And I said, yeah, yeah, I can do that. So I went, I packed all his stuff. Okay. Okay. I went through the list. I, I packed the clothes that he needed, uh-huh. his deodorant. Okay. I made sure that he had all the stuff, put it in there. Clothes, deodorant, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, toothbrush. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. The extra shoes, mm-hmm. all the stuff, his sleeping bag. Yeah. Pillow. I, pillow. I packed all of it. Okay. Socks. Yes. Underwear. Yes. yes. Okay. I packed all of it. I put it in the car. Okay. I drove him to our church. Okay. And when we got there, uh, turns out, because I thought he was going to go there and then they would feed him, they weren't. Oh. I asked. Okay. Because I'm a good dad. Yeah. So I took him to the McDonald's. Yeah. Got him some food. Mm-hmm. And then I put him on the bus. I waved as he, you know, left. Okay. What I'm trying to say is I took him. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I you... did. I did all the things. Yeah. Okay. Your actions led to him being, being there at camp. Yes. Yeah. Saturday morning, mm-hmm. I wake up. 
I'm craving breakfast. Daddy makes a big breakfast yeah. on the weekends. Yeah. Okay, sometimes I make breakfast burritos. Yeah. Sometimes I'll make a giant heaping uh, bowl of oatmeal or for, for everybody. Yeah. 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 Um, uh, fruit smoothies I've been known to make sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. Like Libby makes pancakes better than I do, but yeah. sometimes I will make the pancakes. Pancakes are always welcome. On a very, very special occasion, mm -hmm. usually it's when it's Libby's birthday. Mm -hmm. I you will make, make Bloody Mary's. No, I make French toast. Okay. Okay, and I All make right. really, really good French toast. Yeah. Anyway, so it's Saturday morning. Uh -huh. I'm craving breakfast. I scramble a bunch of eggs. I cut up a bunch of fruit. Okay. okay? I mix all the toast, and mm -hmm. I've got the table set, and I've got everybody's drinks. I've got everybody's uh, mm -hmm. cutlery. The napkins are placed. I've made coffee. Okay. And then I yell, boys. There's a there's Boys. A, there's an S on that. Yeah, boys, plural. Yeah. yeah. Boys. And finally, Jacob says, what? I'm like, it's breakfast. Come downstairs for breakfast. Mm -hmm. And he gets out of bed, and I said, go get your brother. And he goes, Dad, Cameron's not here. Mm. And I said, the hell do you mean Cameron's not here? <laughs> oh, did, I'm like, where is Cameron? Did the word dementia just kind of float in the back of your, <laughs> totally, the back of your head? Totally. I'm like, bit. how could he not? He doesn't have a car. Uh -huh. He doesn't. I mean, no. even, even if he decided to get out of the house and walk somewhere, he doesn't know how to get anywhere. Yeah. Because whenever we go somewhere, he's always playing a game or something on his phone. He doesn't pay attention to what direction we go. Yeah. <laughs> he gets to the end of our neighborhood. He doesn't know if you go right or left or yeah. straight. Okay. So where the hell's Cameron? Mm -hmm. and I said, what do you mean he's not here? And he's like, Dad, Cameron's at camp. I'm oh, like, oh, boy. That's right. Yeah. That is right. <laughs> did, did, did Jacob and Libby give each other a look like, oh, does our insurance cover psychiatric? <laughs> Just to remind you, yeah. I packed him. You did. I took him uh -huh. <laughs> to, to the bus that takes him to camp. Uh -huh. So, And then I completely forgot that yeah. he was at camp. I don't. <laughs> yeah. I, okay. So, so I don't feel so bad about my stories yeah. now. Um, but no, I mean, you yeah. know, it's like I told you that my mom moved up here. She's almost uh -huh. lived here, up here for mm -hmm. a year. Yeah, so it's been a while. Yeah, occasionally mom will say, you know, ask me something. You know, it's like I forgot to bring something to her house. I'm like, mom, I'm lucky I can get out of bed in the morning. Mm -hmm. You know. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, Cameron, I hope you had fun at camp. I don't know. I think he's home. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> as far as I know, I went and got him. I remembered to pick him up. Did you? Did they send you with a picture of him? To... Yeah. Which kid is yours? Yeah. I don't know. Just hand the I was, I was to hoping them. just to recognize by smell. <laughs> I'm waiting for one of the kids yeah. to approach me, yeah. and then I will know that they're my kid. Hand yeah. the guy a Polaroid. So but... Give me one of them right there. <laughs> Tell you what was awesome, though. He got out of the bus. He ran and hugged me. about knocked me down. Oh, that's yeah. nice. Yeah, that's cool. And yeah. I said, are you Cameron? Cameron. Okay, cool. <laughs>